We are less than a week away from Election Day, but in North Carolina, more than half of registered voters have already cast their ballots. According to the latest state voter data, more than 3.7 million people have uh, one-stop shopped early voted or cast an absentee ballot. The state now nearing more than 4.7 million total ballots cast in the 2016 general election and we still have six days to go until Election Day. WCNC Charlotte's Kendall Morris has more for us tonight. The battleground state of North Carolina will come down to the ballot box. We are a true competitive battleground state. And if somebody wins this year by more than two to three percentage points, let alone five points, that could almost be considered a landslide here in North Carolina. Both camps urging their supporters to vote hoping to sway the small margin of percentage points in their direction. North Carolina viewed as a crucial state to win the presidency. It is extremely difficult if Republicans don't have North Carolina because then the likelihood is a bunch of other states have gone Democratic as well. Ivanka Trump visited Charlotte Wednesday, campaigning for votes for her father. And she's really running against the status quo, against Washington for decades, five decades of, of, of Washington bureaucracy. Local Biden support held a news conference for the candidate, highlighting the pains of small business owners in the pandemic. The administration that we have now completely left those individuals out to dry. I feel the Biden and Harris team have a real plan for how we're going to move forward. Both campaigns trying to reach the roughly 50% of North Carolina registered voters who haven't cast their ballot yet, hoping it's enough on election day.